All right, guys, these are two that I do not think are placed yet. This is a black collar and then a uh, dark gray collar. So they're very similar in collar colors. And I just, this is the second time they've been out. You guys probably saw the first video. And you notice they're a lot stronger going after the sack this time, right? Some of this is age, but every time you do things in patterns, it's the same routine I did last time. Good boy, good. Now I've got a pool out here this time. This is new to them. So I will try to get them introduced to the pool. Yay, good dog, yay. And obviously this little guy is, ooh, look at that full mouth bite. Oh yes. So this is a dark gray colored and then a dark black, a black colored collar. And both of them are, uh, let me see if we've got male and female here. Okay, so this one right here is the black collar and that's a male. And then this gray one is a female, I do believe it. She was the one that's the most tenacious on it. That's a female. I find a lot of times the females are um, a little bit more tenacious and they're young. The hormones come out in the male and it changes. Yeah, look at them go. Yay, good dogs, yay. All right, they're into this. So I didn't have to do anything to stimulate this. They were all over the sack and nothing flat just from the first time. So they don't, they don't take long to learn when you do things in patterns, you know, okay? So we've done this once already and now this is twice. I'll keep doing this. Oops, lost my tie. Ah, good dog, good, yay, good dog, yay. And now I'm gonna cheat a little bit because I'm not gonna get them to go in that pool on their own. So I'll just give them the pool and stimulate them out. So they get to escape right away and get out. So there's no pressure on them at all. They're a little probably tripped out on it in the beginning. <sighs> yay, good dog, yay. Good dog, yay. <laughs> you know, boop, 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 boop. You know, boop, 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 boop. Good dogs. Little alligators is what they are. So I'm going to let you guys go, but this is how we develop our puppies. And hopefully they'll keep going under their homes when they get eight weeks old and they're going home, which is in a couple more weeks. They're already six and a half weeks old. Now I will have them to a point where they'll get used to the rattlestick. Speaking of which, let me go get that now. Start letting them experience different things. You got your anchor and the new sound, right? And notice the dog's apprehension taken off. I reduced my sound or stop it all together. Now we're just doing noise stimulation now. They don't have a clue about what's going on. Good. My rattle stick. It's the same stick that they use in ring sport. And I'm going to take little boy here, put him in the pool. Little boy here, put him in the pool. And they try to stimulate him out, but not all already. <laughs> Sorry about the jumble, but it's hard for me to handle camera and do all this stuff at the same time. Get up, 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 up. Ah, you little turd. You little turd. I can't get it away from you. Oh, 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 oh. What I'm trying to do is get him in the pool. Yeah, good boy. Good. Yay, there he goes. And that getting out and being able to escape away from it is real important if you do it slowly. Uh-oh. <laughs> we got problems. We got problems. <laughs> <laughs> Good dog, yay! Here we go. Here you go, baby. Come on, baby. Now you see why that anchor is so important because you'll be able to get them through all this new stuff. And then you just use that anchor to layer that anchor on top of it so they don't. <laughs> hey, come back here with that sack, buddy. Hey, you! Come here back here with that sack, huh? Come here back here with that sack. You, boop, 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 boop. Tails high, checking out the world. It's all about noise right now at this point. They're only used to what they got going on in their little environment, right? They've got me as their security blanket. Yeah, boop, 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 boop
Good dogs. And that's all you want, short and sweet. We're done already with these guys. Don't need much, just a little taste and then get them out of it. Yay, good dog, leave their heads in the best place you can. When you want to leave, you always do the end thing. The last thing they remember should be very positive, right? That's why I'm throwing the sack in here. I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good night.